It began like any other day, a plane preparing for a routine flight. Passengers boarded, luggage stowed, the crew made ready for departure. But this flight, Malaysia Airlines Flight 370, would soon become etched in history, not for reaching its destination, but for vanishing without a trace. On March 8, 2014, a Boeing 777 carrying 239 souls took off from Kuala Lumpur, bound for Beijing. Little did anyone know, this was the start of one of the most baffling mysteries in aviation history. The disappearance of MH370 sent shockwaves across the globe. Families clung to hope as the world watched, bewildered, as days turned into weeks, then months, then years. The initial disbelief gave way to a gnawing sense of mystery, a puzzle with pieces that refused to fit. How could a modern aircraft equipped with cutting-edge technology simply vanish in the 21st century? The search for MH370 became an unprecedented international effort, spanning vast stretches of ocean and involving cutting-edge technology. Every scrap of data was scrutinized, every possible scenario explored. Yet despite the tireless efforts, the plane remained elusive, its fate shrouded in a veil of uncertainty. The lack of concrete answers only deepened the mystery, fueling speculation and giving rise to numerous theories, each more perplexing than the last. This is the story of Flight MH370, a tale of a routine flight that turned into an enigma, a story of cutting-edge technology failing to solve a modern-day mystery, and a story of families left grappling with the agonizing pain of unanswered questions. It's a story that continues to haunt us, a stark reminder of the mysteries that even our technologically advanced world can't always unravel. MH370 was a scheduled passenger flight from Kuala Lumpur International Airport to Beijing Capital International Airport. The aircraft, a Boeing 777-200ER, was relatively new, delivered to Malaysia Airlines just nine years prior. With a clean safety record and a seasoned crew, nothing seemed out of the ordinary on that fateful night. The flight crew consisted of Captain Zahari Ahmad Shah, a veteran pilot with over 18,000 flight hours, and First Officer Farik Abdul Hamid, a young pilot undergoing training. Both were highly experienced and well-regarded within the airline. The passenger manifest reflected the global nature of air travel, with individuals from 14 different nationalities on board. Among the passengers were seasoned business travelers, excited tourists, and families returning home after holidays. They carried with them hopes, dreams, and stories that would sadly remain untold. Their lives intertwined by this ill-fated flight would be forever linked by the mystery that unfolded. As the plane taxied for takeoff, everything seemed routine. The weather was clear, communication with air traffic control was normal, and the flight plan was straightforward. There was no indication of any mechanical issues, suspicious behavior, or external threats. The stage was set for a routine flight, one that would tragically become anything but. The first sign of trouble came just 38 minutes after takeoff. As MH370 was transitioning from Malaysian to Vietnamese airspace, the plane's transponder, which broadcasts its location, suddenly stopped transmitting. Air traffic controllers in Kuala Lumpur tried to contact the aircraft, but there was no response. The plane, which should have been cruising at 35,000 feet, deviated from its planned flight path, turning sharply west. Military radar tracked MH370 as it flew across the Malay Peninsula and out over the Andaman Sea. Then, just as abruptly as it had turned, the plane disappeared from radar screens. The sudden disappearance triggered a massive search and rescue operation, one of the largest and most complex in aviation history. Malaysia, Vietnam, China, and other countries deployed ships and aircraft to scour the waters of the South China Sea, where the plane was last detected. However, days turned into weeks, and the search yielded no results. The lack of any debris, distress signals, or communication from the plane deepened the mystery. The world watched in disbelief, grappling with the impossible. A modern jetliner had vanished without a trace. Theories began to emerge, ranging from mechanical failure to hijacking, to deliberate pilot action, but none could definitively explain what happened to MH370. The initial search for MH370 focused on the South China Sea, based on the last radar contact. However, as days turned into weeks without any sign of the aircraft, the search area expanded dramatically. Satellite data, analyzed weeks after the disappearance, indicated that the plane had continued flying for several hours after its last radar contact sending routine handshakes to a satellite. 
This new data shifted the search to the Southern Indian Ocean, a vast and remote expanse of water. The search effort, now coordinated by the Australian government, involved ships, aircraft, and underwater vehicles equipped with sonar. The challenges were immense, rough seas, strong currents, and depths exceeding 6,000 meters in some areas. Despite the Herculean efforts, the search for MH370 remained frustratingly elusive. Months turned into years, and the search yielded only a few pieces of debris confirmed to be from the missing plane. These fragments, found washed ashore on islands in the Indian Ocean, provided tantalizing clues but offered no definitive answers about the plane's final resting place. The official search for MH370 was suspended in January 2017, after almost three years of intensive efforts. The decision was met with disappointment and frustration by the families of those on board, who still yearned for answers. The suspension of the search marked a somber chapter in the story of MH370, but it did not extinguish the hope that one day, the mystery would be solved. While the primary radar lost contact with MH370, another form of communication provided a faint trail. The aircraft continued to exchange automated handshakes with a satellite owned by Inmarsat, a British satellite telecommunications company. These handshakes, though not designed for location tracking, offered valuable clues about the plane's general direction and movement. Analysis of the satellite data revealed that MH370 had flown south for several hours after its last radar contact, traversing the Indian Ocean. The data, while not pinpointing the exact location, narrowed down the search area considerably. It also offered insights into the plane's altitude and speed, suggesting a deliberate course change rather than a sudden catastrophic event. The satellite handshakes, though limited in detail, provided the most significant lead in the search for MH370. They shifted the focus from the South China Sea to the vast expanse of the Indian Ocean, a daunting task for search and rescue teams. The data also fueled speculation about the plane's final hours, raising more questions than answers. The satellite handshakes, a testament to the interconnected nature of modern technology became a crucial piece of the puzzle. They offered a glimmer of hope in the face of overwhelming uncertainty, a faint trail in the vast expanse of the ocean. However, they also served as a reminder of the limitations of technology. Unable to provide a definitive answer to the mystery of MH370's disappearance. The absence of a definitive explanation for MH370's disappearance has spawned numerous theories, each attempting to piece together the puzzle. These theories range from the plausible to the outlandish, reflecting the complexity of the case and the lack of concrete evidence. One of the most prominent theories suggests a deliberate act by the pilot, Captain Zahari Ahmad Shah. Proponents of this theory point to his experience, knowledge of the aircraft, and the deliberate nature of the plane's course change. However, investigations into the captain's background revealed no obvious motive, leaving this theory open to debate. Other theories focus on mechanical failures, such as a sudden decompression or a fire, which could have incapacitated the crew and led to the plane's deviation. However, the lack of any distress signals in the seemingly controlled flight path cast doubt on these explanations. Some theories even venture into the realm of conspiracy, suggesting hijacking by unknown entities or even a deliberate act of terrorism. The proliferation of theories, each with its own set of arguments and counterarguments, underscores the perplexing nature of the MH370 mystery. Without concrete evidence, the truth remains elusive, leaving the world to grapple with a multitude of possibilities, none of which offer a definitive answer. Beyond the technical complexities and investigative challenges, the disappearance of MH370 represents a profound human tragedy. The 239 souls on board, each with their own stories, dreams, and aspirations, became victims of a mystery that continues to haunt their families and the world. For the families of those lost on MH370, the pain is immeasurable. The lack of closure, the absence of a final resting place, and the unanswered questions have left them in a state of perpetual grief and uncertainty. Their lives have been irrevocably altered, marked by a loss that defies comprehension. The disappearance of MH370 serves as a stark reminder of the fragility of life and the profound impact that such events have on those left behind. The human cost of this tragedy extends beyond the immediate families affecting friends, colleagues, and communities around the world. The outpouring of sympathy and support from across the globe reflects the shared sense of loss 
and the universal desire for answers. The story of MH370 is ultimately a human story, a story of lives intertwined by fate, a story of loss, grief, and the enduring search for truth. It's a story that reminds us of the importance of compassion, empathy, and the need to support those who have been touched by such unimaginable tragedy. The disappearance of MH370 has had a profound impact on the aviation industry, prompting a reassessment of safety protocols and a renewed focus on tracking and communication technologies. The incident exposed vulnerabilities in existing systems and highlighted the need for improvements to prevent similar occurrences in the future. One of the key changes implemented in the wake of MH370 is the requirement for more frequent aircraft tracking. The International Civil Aviation Organization ICAO, now mandates that airlines track their aircraft at least every 15 minutes, reducing the time an aircraft could go missing without detection. Another significant change involves the development of new tracking technologies. Several companies are working on systems that use satellite-based communication to provide real-time tracking of aircraft, even in remote areas. These technologies aim to eliminate the gaps in coverage that contributed to the difficulty in locating MH370. The disappearance of MH370 has served as a catalyst for advancements in aviation safety. The lessons learned from this tragedy have led to improvements in tracking, communication, and search and rescue capabilities, making air travel safer for everyone. However, the incident also serves as a reminder that despite technological advancements, aviation still faces inherent risks, and the quest for safer skies is an ongoing endeavor. Despite years of investigation, countless theories, and advancements in technology, the disappearance of MH370 remains an unsolved mystery. The lack of a definitive explanation continues to baffle experts and haunt the families of those lost on board. The central question that remains unanswered is, of course, what happened to MH370? Did the plane suffer a catastrophic mechanical failure? Was there a deliberate act by the pilot? Or was there another, yet unknown, factor at play? The absence of concrete evidence leaves these questions open to speculation with no definitive answers in sight. Another unanswered question is the location of the plane's wreckage. Despite extensive searches, only a few pieces of debris have been recovered, offering tantalizing clues, but no definitive answer to the plane's final resting place. The vastness of the Indian Ocean and the challenges of deep sea exploration make the search for the wreckage a daunting task. The mystery of MH370 serves as a stark reminder of the limits of human knowledge and the enduring power of the unknown. It's a story that continues to captivate the world, a story that demands answers, yet may forever remain shrouded in mystery. The search for truth continues, driven by the hope that one day, the puzzle of MH370 will be solved, offering closure to the families and a resolution to one of aviation's most enduring enigmas.